It's time on Tornado Titans. I'm in Northwest Texas and this storm is doing amazing things. Before I get started, I just want to dedicate this video to my dad. He was one of the greatest people I know, my biggest supporter, and he was instrumental in Tornado Titans being where it is, me being where I am today. And dad, I hope you're watching this video from up in heaven and yeah, this one's for you. So I'm sitting in my niece's bedroom right now, or her old bedroom. Got all kinds of great decorations preparing for today's chase. Uh, target is Southwest Oklahoma, Western North Texas. So we're gonna see how today goes, but you know, it's looking pretty good so far. And I'm excited about that. I'm excited to see storms. So I guess let's go do this. Let's get this done. So today's storm chase is a lot different than the last one. We've got a lot of instability, a lot of sunshine. I've got to drive south of this warm front to get there, but it's going to be blue skies and it's going to look really amazing. I'm ready. Let's get this started. Everything is pointing this area just south of Vernon. Just looking at medical analysis here, as promised. Look at that, you can see some blue sky sun breaking through. With this being my first chase season back in two years, meeting up with old friends, Brandon and Brett is incredible. Fellow Titans, they're incredible chasers. And of course, of course, we would be in the same spot waiting on the storms because that's just how we roll. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah it's, it's moving 17 mile an hour. Wow, that's barely That's what we that. need. I'm all right with that. So. Yeah. Now, as we watch storms go up all around us, you know, these towers look incredible. They look like they're high instability towers. This isn't that March stuff. This is real deal storm stuff. And there's a really interesting storm taking shape near Childress. And this one's probably the one. It's on the triple point. So it's time to get in the car and get after it. It's got like a little wall cloud on it already. That's unexpected. And so we get close to this storm and it just kind of fizzles and I, you know, you're not expecting that. This base is flat. It doesn't look like a tornado is imminent. Like, are we, I mean, is this going to work out today? I don't know that the storm definitely is not working out right now. In Swearingen, Texas right now, looking at this supercell. It's trying to be interesting. It's tornado warned right now, so just gonna keep an eye on it, see what happens, but pretty classic positioning right now. Doing good. I keep running into these guys. I mean, this storm is not ready to produce a tornado anytime soon, so it's time to reposition and get in the right spot. So I can't help myself. This storm to my south looks incredible. It's got like this beautiful LP, almost like bell shape to it. So I have to stop and get some, you know, get some film of it. I mean, I have to, but you know, I wasn't expecting that this storm to my north, the main storm would ramp up and be ready to produce a tornado. It's, it's time to hurry now. So I'm driving north, I'm driving north. I'm trying to get a good view of this storm and I can't see anything until suddenly I could see something. There's a funnel and it's like halfway down to the ground. I am not in position, uh-oh. <laughs> it's better than not seeing it, that's for sure. I'm complaining about seeing a tornado. Ah, uh, a couple more minutes earlier and I would have got the whole life cycle. Might do it again though. Is this the only tornado I'm going to see today? That's the thought running through my mind. It's 10 miles away. I would be very frustrated if this is all I see today. So I'm gonna have to let this storm get closer to me and we're just gonna have to hope it does something when it's closer to me. And that's pretty much the plan right now. This storm is not done. It's very clear. I'm about to see another tornado and this one's gonna be a lot closer. Here we go.
These are both baby tornadoes, but I'm seeing two tornadoes on the ground at the same time. Whoa, this is really cool and somewhat unexpected, to be honest with you. Wow. Look at that. So the twins are on their way out, but there is still a very strong rotating area. This thing is about to plant a tornado, and I think it's going to be absolutely gorgeous. So here's a storm chasing pro tip. Never chase with eyeglasses on. Don't chase with these because there's water everywhere. I'm wiping off my glasses. There's a tornado on the ground. I'm trying to film the tornado. Then I'm trying to drive and it's just like, it's a nightmare. This is a nightmare. I cannot stress enough. Never wear eyeglasses while storm chasing. And just as soon as this tornado, it felt like it formed, it was gone. And I'm sitting here, I'm still dealing with water on my eyeglasses, water in the car, water on the camera. It's just like, it, it's pretty rough. So I'm driving, I'm trying to get in a better position. I kind of lose my wits a little bit, which does happen sometimes in storm chasing, but I wasn't sure which road to take or anything. Then all of a sudden I see Brandon Sullivan pull in front of me and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna follow them because that makes this a lot easier. And lo and behold, as I'm driving east, all of a sudden I look over and this tornado has planted and it is amazing, <laughs> incredible. You gotta check it out. Another tornado right here. This is right out there. The storm does not know when to quit. So today went from zero to a hundred so fast. I thought for a minute there when I was witnessing that tornado from like 10 miles away, oh my gosh, I'm not gonna see anything today. I went from that to seeing five tornadoes and two of them were some of the most beautiful tornadoes you've ever seen. Just an incredible day. Today's a classic chase day. This one's going to go down in the record books. I'm so thankful I was here. I was just being in good position, executing the chase somewhat almost flawlessly. Honestly, I, I might have messed up with the glasses thing, but everything else really worked out. I'm super excited. Chasing is just like, it's happening this year. Things are going well, so whew, let's do it.